Hi, welcome to Mirador Television. My name is Mark Payton and I'm outside the offices of Strand Parker and Lewis. Uh, Adrian Passing, the, the partner there, is going to talk to us now about the property market in 2020. Over to you, Adrian. Adrian Passingham. I've been an estate agent for 38 years, uh, predominantly in Sussex. Property's been a passion, always has been. My father was an estate agent before me, which I suppose has, has probably led me into it. I was also a fireman for eight and a half years, a retained fireman in Burgess Hill, so looking after the community, uh, very much a community man. Um, so sort of selling houses during the day and putting them out at night. Stratton Parker as a company, we have got over 60 offices across the country, 10 of which are in London, so we have a very strong presence in London uh, and in the market we're in at the moment that's fantastic it's invaluable it uh, uh, having direct access to the people that are moving out out of London the company was started back I believe in 1934 and the Lewis branch where I'm uh, which is one I run uh, that's the largest office outside of London um, the uh, area that Lewis office covers is all of East Sussex. Um, our associated offices locally are Canterbury, Seven Oaks, Horsham, um, although Horsham's a virtual office now, so we're trying that, that angle as well. Um, and then we've got uh, Guildford, Chichester. With majority of property, um, we have a, a huge mixed bag. The quirky, the unusual, large, small, um, listed, whether it's grade, grade one, grade two, grade two star, um, we specialize in, yes, the, the unusual. Um, seen some absolutely gorgeous properties, uh, I've seen some not so nice properties as well but if it's a not so nice property, we can give advice on what to do. The Horsham branch, we're running that as a virtual branch. It was something that was decided during the COVID, uh, uh, COVID outbreak, because COVID obviously has had a major effect on the property market. Um, the other thing COVID has done is, uh, I think changed people's perspective on how and where they need to work. Um, as long as the property's got very good broadband, um, people do know that they can now work from home. It used to be a case of the, uh, the London workers, were, they needed that umbilical cord between their home and London. Um, they still won't sever that, they still like the ability or the thought of going back to London, but the, um, the amount of time they go back to London is, is, is diminishing. So it's a case that they will buy, they buy a country home thinking we'll go to London twice a week uh, rather than every single day. It has made people realize that they don't want neighbors as close as they are at the moment. It is a case of they, they need space between them and, and the next person. Uh, living in a flat where they've got no outdoor space, obviously going, th going through lockdown was, um, I, I couldn't, uh, can't imagine it really, um, but it's not very nice. So, so that has encouraged people to uh, go out into country, country homes. Country properties weren't really in favour um, during Brexit. But once we got through the first lockdown, it was like a tsunami of people coming out of London to buy homes in the country where they've got outside space, they've got, might have swimming pools, might have tennis courts, they've got facilities that which can keep them, um, keep them busy. Virtual tours have been fantastic. 
they do give you a very good uh, indication of the of the property but you can't physically beat that stepping over the front door um, so the so the trying it as a virtual office as well as Horsham is running has been extremely successful uh, the well-being of our clients is is vitally important so we adopted uh, very early on the virtual tours um, and we're asking people to to view a property virtually before actually physically going over the front door. What I bring to the table with regard to uh, estate agency is uh, honesty and integrity, I suppose. Um, it is a case of telling people realities, how it is with regard to, to values, uh, what they can expect um, in trying to sell a property. Uh, the pitfalls that they're going to go through. Strutton Parker, it's one big family and that family is united in the fact that we all work together, we don't work against each other and the most important person in any transaction is our client. Uh, my, the favourite thing about my job is people. I think it's, it, we see people all walks of life and uh, I'm very much a people person and yeah it, it's getting to know people what uh, knowing about people where they want to be and how I can help improve their um, their being and lifestyle by helping them get to where they want to be um, also views I, the, some of the houses I deal with are absolutely gorgeous but the views, I love the views, <laughs> wonderful.